Oh. Good morrow, everybody. And welcome back to another blind e episode of this Let's Play of Legend of Zelda Oracle of Seasons. In the last episode, I had got stumped once again as to what to do. I've been doing a lot of thinking. And while I was off screen, I happened to come across something very interesting. As I now know what to do. I didn't look up anything, I did not go on YouTube or anything. This is all me off screening. This is what you need to do. You need to change the seasons. You need to change the season to winter. Just know the water will freeze. At first I thought I could just go into this waterfall because you could see that little pattern, odd pattern right there. But no, that's not what you have to do at all. What you have to do is first chase in the winter and look at all that, look at all that snow. You really get to walk on that. So let's go inside here. Watch that guy. Oh, really? 
they jumping into the water? see where I'm going. commentary right now. I'm just trying to concentrate. I'm kind of curious to what we're finding here. So I can find me some help in here. Why can't I hit it? Do I have to throw a boomerang at it? 
follow it. Hopefully this is the right for it. Oh, I already have Here. 
got a key! Here's a deal. Ten, let me see. Twenty minutes. Thank you. I think I might have a like, good idea of what's in here. The treasure. I mean, the, the dungeon item. Last time it was the, what, the rock's feather. Can't sit. You see it through my power. Stop. 
got the slingshot! Choose your seeds and take aim. Oh yeah! I knew it!
war's key. I found it. It was in the war. It was in the eye. Ouch. Ouch. Now I just need to find where the boss is. Continue pressing on, and this will continue in the, ne in the next part. So, until then, ladies and gentlemen.